Nobody likes to be told what kind of person they are based on a deck of playing cards or that a total stranger has access to some sort of intellectual underworld that is denied to you. These oddly elitist traits are common to all species of occultist. The occultist tends to have a bearing of smug superiority, which is a little strange to say the least, considering their firm conviction in the utterly unbelievable. They're solitary creatures and always visit the shop unaccompanied, although I suspect this is not through choice. They lack even the most basic social skills, and in most cases seem to have failed to grasp the rudiments of personal hygiene too. Once you've convinced yourself that you're a master of the dark arts, or that you can speak to the dead, you are entitled to adopt a fairly cavalier approach to washing and communicating with the living. The dead, it would appear, have no sense of smell or style. So if you love books and you love bookshops, please do your best to support your local independent bookshop. We're all struggling at the moment and we need all the help we can get. Thank you.